Welcome back to the channel. And um, some shit I open say. Oh yeah. Um, what I'm gonna do is, I think I'm gonna just save my money and just go to uh Arizona and just get a car for my boy. If you got him on Facebook, Justin Miss. I don't know how to say his last name. His first name Justin. He out of Mesa, Arizona. I think Mesa. Yeah, Mesa, Arizona. And on YouTube, it's 06 Crown Vic. Uh, I'm going to go out there and get a call from him because, you know, I, I look at it like this. You know, I can go to Arizona get a, a rust-free car. A car that ain't got no rust. Um, and a car that got AC. Because out there in Arizona, state law is they can't sell a car that ain't got AC. If it ain't got AC, they got to fix it. It got to have AC by the time they sell it. And another thing, I done seen his work. You know, I done seen him fix cars up. And, um... You know, like, get cars and fix them up and sell them. You know, he clean the inside, outside, make sure it's mechanically sound. So, what I think I'll do, I think I'll do that 26-hour drive back. You know, just fly down there and do a 26-hour drive back. Just stop at hotels. Be like my boy East Coast Classics when he went and got the BMW just recently. Um... Um, they would... He, him and his kids had drove from California from LA to Waco, Texas. Well, the BMW been left at WJ Handy there shop. Uh, I think I might do a drive like that, but it, it'll only be me doing a drive. You know, I'll be by myself. So I'm going to definitely have to stop at hotels. And but even if I had, a, had another drive, I was going to have to stop at hotels anyways. But you know, it ain't gonna be like, you know, we drive, I, I drive eight hours, you drive eight hours. It ain't none of that. It's, you know, drive so long, then stop at a hotel, you know, which I'm probably try to drive 12 hours, uh, 12 to 14 hours, then stop at a hotel overnight. Then, uh, you know, um, get some sleep, then hit the road again, so that's what I'm going to try to do. That's how I'm, how, that's how I'm going to do it. Because, uh, that, that's what I really think I'm going to do. I really think I'm going to just save, save me some money. You know, at least I know if I get the car from him, you know, at least I know it ain't bullshit. You know, and I ain't got to worry about nothing immediate, like fixing nothing right off the bat and stuff like that. Or like buying a car here in Illinois. I know it's going to be rusty underneath. And uh, all that and then fixing it. So, I know I won't have to worry about that, you know, buying it from him. So... Be it, right? What's that car blowing that moose for? Blowing up. Uh. But you know, I know, I, I know, I'm not gonna have to worry about that. So, oh, what I think I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna just go get a call from him and call it one. You know, cause like I said, I seen his work. I like how he do his car. Ooh, Vic. Oh, no, nah, y'all got me fucked up. Nope. I ain't jumping on that. Why the fuck is the, why the, fuck the check engine light popped on? Cars are true. None of the motherfucking check engine like popped on. Uh, 
I'm gonna go ahead and go to the shop and see what's to that. Let me jump out, boys. But yeah, he yeah, had just inboxed me on Facebook anyways and let me know. He like, man, you know, be patient. He like, man, I'll help you. You know, I'll, I'll get you a car, you know, this and that, which I know he will because he said that before. You know, I just ain't ready yet. So I'm definitely get ready. I right, crack head off and smash you in that goddamn bike. I don't give a fuck about you. Get your ass splattered over here on Pulaski, in that Madison. But yeah, so uh, that's how it's gonna be. You know, that's how I'm gonna do it. And uh, something else I was gonna say. But bus driver slow as fuck. But yeah, so most like me, I'm definitely looking for another Vic. But I did see he got an Apollo 9 But I don't know, you know, if I get all the money for the car, for the plane ticket, uh, for like a little temporary tag down there, hotel and gas, it'll be a go. You know, but that's gonna be quite a bit of money. I think like if you want, like let's say if you want twenty five for the car, I'm gonna need at least thirty five hundred. So, yeah. But I'll let y'all know how that goes, cause I'm gonna definitely try to get it. And um. You know, like I say, you know, rust free, can't go wrong with that. Cannot go wrong with a rust free car. But yeah, so. What y'all think I should do? Just be patient, go and get one from Arizona. You know, uh, uh drop y'all comments below. Like, comment, subscribe. Catch y'all in the next video.